All right, what's going on guys? Nizu here. Today I just wanted to show you my limited edition framed lithograph. Uh, this is called Boardwalk, and this is from the game Bioshock Infinite. And these are concept pieces that show the architectural palette and direction for a area in Bioshock Infinite's City of Columbia. And uh, this concept art was done by Scott Duquette, who joined the Irrational Games staff last year. Uh, the print itself measures 17 by 11, and it's printed on a very high quality paper called vellum. It's uh, a very durable paper. It's, uh, it's most often used for special documents and manuscripts, things that are meant to be preserved. So this will last forever. I can pass this on to my children. My children can turn around and pass it on to their children. And this concept art can last forever in my family. And that's exactly what I intend to do. That's my plan and I'm sticking to it. Um, it is professionally framed and matted. Beautiful black wood frame. And the overall frame measures 20 by 14. This print is extremely limited. Only 100 were, were made. It includes a certificate of authenticity, which is hand numbered and signed by Ken Levine. For those who don't know who Ken Levine is, he is the mastermind and genius behind Bioshock and Bioshock Infinite. He is the creative director and co-founder of Irrational Games. And uh, the only thing that I wish is that this was signed, personally signed by Scott Ducat. That would have made this uh, awesome. But um, who knows? Maybe it is signed on the actual backside of the print itself, but they don't say that it's signed, and I can't see that it's signed because the back side of the frame is sealed off with paper. So so who knows? Maybe I will maybe I will tweet Ken Levine and Irrational Games and just try to find out if it's signed by him. But anyways, I will settle for Ken Levine's signature. That is fine. Uh, Scott Duquette, I didn't know much about him, but he joined the Irrational Games staff last year. He specializes in architecture, illustration, concept art, 3D modeling, painted and photo-based textures. He's very experienced with a broad range of roles within game development, including asset creation, modular construction systems, style guide creation, level design, texture painting, environment concept painting, prop concepting, and particle effects. His areas of special interest include architecture, town and city layout, and both painterly and photorealistic texturing and art styles. Uh, here is a man with vision, and his vision is brilliant. Uh, I just love the concept art here, and I'm just very happy to have it in my collection. This is the back side of the frame, and as you can see, it already has the hardware on the back side, so you can hang it up on your wall immediately. It also has uh, little rubber feet on the bottom corners so that it, uh, it doesn't damage your wall and it stays put, which is great. Very professionally done here. And like I said, it also comes with a certificate of authenticity, which is signed by Ken Levine. And it's also individually numbered. Uh, as you can see here, I have number 46 out of 100. And the number 46 is also written in pencil on the bottom right-hand corner of the frame uh, on the paper backing. Overall, I just, I just love this lithograph. It just looks great on my shelf, and I have it sitting next to the... I also got the Trio Lithograph signed set from Irrational Games, and they just look great together. Uh, I'm really happy. I'm really fortunate to have these in my collection. 
I just wanted to show you guys, if you have any questions at all, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. I will also leave a link for this lithograph in the description as well. This is Nizu. Hope you enjoyed the video. Take care, guys.